So for this build we're going to be using this Hot Wheels Salt Shaker which is obviously a jet powered land speed record car. Uh, my initial plan is just to paint it grey and make it look more like a jet. Add a, maybe a machine gun and a rocket pod. It'll be a very simple build, I don't really plan to do any modifications to this, just add a couple of weapons and paint it grey. So it shouldn't be that bad. I am probably going to paint the wheels too because I think a lot of land speed record cars, the wheels are made of solid lead or solid aluminium. I'm not an expert on those cars, I can't remember, but I know they're made of solid metal usually or they used to have a very thin tyre wrapped around. So I'm a little further on on the uh, salt shaker, which I'm thinking of calling afterburner. So I took a Dremel and cut out a panel here to make it look like the panel is just ripped off because this thing's drive long and I'm going to weather it up to look like that. I did scar a panel here because I did cut the other one here. Oops. But I think I'm going to glue that one back on. I kind of made a hack job with this one. But I think I'll fix it up with some sanding. Um, use the auto kill rocket launchers and an auto kill machine gun. I've trimmed them down to fit in. Try and make them more aerodynamic and fit in with the vehicle. This one's not going to be as heavily weathered. This one's just going to be more of a clean cut. Um, I also... Um, I also had to paint it because this is all translucent yellow so I had to paint it before I could glue the rockets on so it didn't fog up and ruin the canopy here because you can still see inside I'm probably going to paint the interior pieces black so you can just about see them so I'll just pop this so you can just see I don't have it paint there we go So you can just see the cockpit with a salt bright chrome. So I'm probably going to paint that black so you can see it better through the, the visor. And I'm also going to clean that up a bit more. So you'll see them in the next bit. Here's the finished result of Afterburner. As you can see it might be a bit different grey because I had to repaint it and unfortunately didn't have any of that grey left. Um, really was just a simple build so it's probably going to be a short video. Um, wish I'd kind of cleaned up this a bit better, but I really couldn't do much with what I had. I kind of hacked away a bit too much. I should have used my Dremel and cut it like I did the other side, which cleaned up the other side if you look. This one looks a lot more clean. But the idea is these are just panels that have blown off and they've just left them off for ease of maintenance sort of thing. Um, used some green stuff to act as a shroud for the machine gun. Um, overall, this is just really a vehicle that's obviously you've just built for speed. I'd say this would be a one-up from a performance vehicle, considering it's jet-powered and all, and it's somewhat aerodynamic. Like usual, there'll be a nice little slideshow at the end with some better images of this. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.